Hello, Helen Chin Lu here, certified reflexologist, certified energy medicine practitioner, Reiki master and teacher, the owner of the Healing Place and the Healing Place Energy School. I will put up my book, Know Your Chakras. See, you're going to pretend I have my book here. I'm the author of Know Your Chakras. I want you to think about getting that book. Today, because you have asked, we're going to address sciatic nerve. And being the geeky mind that I am, I'm going to talk about the sciatic nerve. Uh, in the body and where it's located in the feet and what you could do to get relief fast. So here I am, this is my diagram. Can you check this out? Your sciatic nerve is part, is the longest nerve in your body. So you see it up here? It goes all the way down from your lumbar vertebrae. I think this is like L4. And it goes all the way down your leg to your feet and so forth and so on. So if something is pinching, obviously it's not only going to hurt your back, your leg where it just radiates pain and then the pain works all the way down into your calves and into the feet. So I'm going to show you where to press on the leg to get relief. So here is Andrew. I am going to work on his sciatic nerve. So I've already drew, drew on his leg. You see this blue arrow right here? Your sciatic nerve is, begins here on the reflex point, goes all the way up the leg. You could use your bare hands. I'm going to use lotion and I'm going to press in. This is a pretty forceful press. I'm oiling his leg and you could go all the way up to the knee. Usually reflexology just goes up to the ankles, but I have a tendency I like to work all the way up to the knees. And if, if depending on who you're working on, you could even go further past the knees and really address the sciatic nerve. So I'm gonna support the foot uh, with my uh, with my non-working hand, holding on to his heel, using my thumb, and watch how I press. Notice my nail is turning white, so it's a pretty forceful walk. And you're going to either press through a thumb walk like this, or you could slide. I prefer to do a thumb walk because I want to see where the energy congestion is. Like I could feel it here, and Angel's really being nice. He's not. He's trying hard not to scream. And I am going to work using my other thumb, and I'm going to work all the way up. And I strongly suggest people say, "Well, my." sciatic nerve is bothering me on my right leg. Do both legs because what happens a lot of times we have a tendency once we have a pain in one limb the other limb will overcompensate and start to work harder because obviously your, your legs are trying to support your body. So this is my tip. This is going to give relief. How often to do this? I would strongly suggest you could do it a couple of times a day maybe for about 20 to 30 seconds. If you have more time, you could work up to a minute. And, and then you could also do it every single day. After you're done, drink plenty of fluids to flush out built up toxin. Does that bother you, Andrew? A little painful. A little painful. He's good. He, <laughs> he really wants to scream, but he's not going to. So this is Helen Chin Lu. I'm gonna turn it to me now. Helen Chin Lu from The Healing Place. This is a great little tip. Give it a try. Subscribe to The Healing Place Energy School um, channel right now, Reflexology Healing, and I'll talk to you really soon.